I'm Mr. White Christmas. I'm Mr. Snow. <laughs> Hello friends, my name is Brandon Dayton. I'm your humble narrator, and welcome to part number six of our Pokemon Fire Red randomized Nuzlocke. Yes, it's been a difficult trek towards Mount Moon, but we overcame three or four trainers in the last episode, and uh, I plan to overcome three or four more in this episode. So, there's a sneaky guy down here. I'm gonna see what's up with him. And there's grass we can get some more fucking pokes. Hey, you're not wearing shorts. What's wrong with you? What's wrong with you, bro? Get out of my face. Ask me all kinds of weird questions. Who are you? Oh, some guy with a Hitmonlee. That's who you are. I need to get Squirrel out of there, I think. But Acorn's also going to be weak to it, and so is Clam Slam. Holy shit, when he evolves. So I probably won't give him a Water Stone just yet. Let's see what this fucking thing has. I don't think it has High Jump Kick. Oh, it has Rolling Kick. Holy shit. We do need to switch out here. <laughs> Getting a little too brave for my own fucking good. And it's level 14, so, uh... Definitely a force to be reckoned with. The Kicking Fiend, Hitmonlee! And he goes for revenge. That's actually, uh, pretty hurdy. Can we fucking get a supersonic on this thing, please? 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 Supersonic! Fuck. Shit. Damn it! Try Icicle Spear. Rolling Kick misses again, thank goodness. I don't know how hard it's gonna hit. Oh, I Icicle Spear does nothing! Fuck. Alright. Get the potions out. Get Clam Slam on his feet. Fuck, everything I have is afraid of this thing. And the more I hit it, the more its revenge does to me. Ugh! We need to fucking... Here, we'll withdraw. That's what we'll do. He's gonna raise his attack with Meditate, apparently. Oh, God. Withdraw! We need to fucking boost. Boost, boost, boost! And hopefully we can overcome this thing with a little more fucking cheesing. Ugh. I hate you, Hitmonlee. I hate you! Oh, there's the fucking rolling kick. Holy shit. Almost fucking just nailed. Oh my god. I cannot lose Clam Slam. I cannot. Fucking revenge. Ugh. Okay, we're good. We're fine. We tackle. Oh, the double kick. Oh, the double kick. Oh god. Please kill it. Fuck. What an asshole. Absolutely devastated Clam Slam, but he lived with a couple potions. He lived. I'm, I'm, I hate that I'm spending all these potions, especially that I know I'm kind of low on funds, but it's all right. It's what we got to do. But I do want to get to that grass and see uh, what our new Pokemon might be. I should switch Acorn to the front. He's level 16. Everybody's 17. They're gonna leave him behind. All right. Hey, lady. That look you gave me, it's so intriguing. Well, well. How'd you like to play with my Pokeballs? <laughs> That's gross. Oh, another Ho-Ho! Are you fucking kidding me? God damn it. Hopefully it just has Whirlwind. I don't know. Maybe it learns Ember at level 10. That would be a, a horrible surprise. Here's the whirlwind! Fuck. Clam Slam. Why are you so low on health? Fuck it's supersonic. Why not? Why is it always miss? We need Confuse Ray is what we need. This ain't working out. Supersonic? No? No? I think the accuracy is only like 60% or some shit like that. Really, really bad. Alright. Squirrel's gonna tackle this thing. And then Nuzleaf's gonna come, and go swift it. <laughs> I'm so glad it doesn't have fucking horrible moves yet. It's gonna be really bad when I find out that it gets, like, Peck and Ember and shit. And just devastates my, uh, my Nuzleaf. Yay! Everybody gets some XP! 
Clam slams the finisher. That's hilarious. Hooray! Acorn! You're going up so fast. He's fast, actually. 33 speed. Wow. I am impressed. And she's got a Torkoal now. So I'm gonna send in Squirrel to take care of this thing. I know its defenses are high as shit, but it is only level 10. We're almost double its level now. And that's mostly because we have so few Pokemon um, to train. But oh well. I'm not gonna complain about that. I'd rather have three overlevel Pokemon than a team of six that fucking falls apart on me. So, uh, I guess I understand why the trainers in games always have, like, only three or four Pokemon at the most. But I'm gonna fill up my team if I'm able to. Um, but I don't know. Everybody's kinda high level now. <laughs> oh, please don't poison me. That's such a dick move. Ugh. I keep missing. Why do I keep missing? He's cursing up to fucking oblivion. God damn. We're not gonna be able to break through pretty soon here unless we start some tail whips, but I don't have time to tail whip because he's smogging and I'm gonna get poisoned and I don't have a fucking shit ton of antidotes. I've got five and not really much money to buy another. And I can't switch Nuzleaf in here. So, uh, hopefully we'll live through... Yeah, okay. Okay, good job. Be nice. No you, bitch. Jesus Christ. Get this antidote. Could use a trip to the Pokemon Center, but there's only one guy left. I bet we could beat that ass. <laughs> Watch him just shut us down. I'll battle you with the Pokemon I just caught. Oh, will you? What did you find in the grass? A lily. Alright. A rock bug. We can, uh... We'll bide. I, I love bide. Yep. Constrict. That'll work fine. Hit me again. Astonish. Not very effective because of my dark type. And then I unleash energy! How'd it do? Not too great. Alright, let's try the Swift then. He's not really doing much damage to us either, so... I'm not super worried about Lilip. It's not very effective. But I think it did about as much as the Bide, so we'll just... Fire off a few more of these. See what his second poke be. I'm not too worried about this creepy little thing. Look into its eyes. Look into its deadlights. <laughs> oh. What a horrible thing. I like Cradley a lot, but Lilip just looks creepy. Looks like it should be a part ghost or something. It gets Astonish, which is a ghost type move. <laughs> the more you know! Da da da! Turned into Swift! Yaw! Good. Oh, we're whittling this thing down pretty quick. Constrict is a horribly ineffective move. I think it has a power of like 10. <laughs> and then it drops the speed by 10% um, with a 10% chance or some shit. It's awful. It's really awful. <laughs> it's 50% with a 10% chance, but god damn, it's terrible. <laughs> and he's got an Illumise, which is a bug type. Might fuck with my acorn just a little bit. And I can't really risk it, because he's like, dark and plant type. So, I'm gonna just bring in the squirrel, and hopefully lure the bug type move if it has it. No, it charms the shit out of me. God damn. That's alright, maybe that's all it has. Just keep tackling! Ha ha! Same type attack bonus, tackle! And she's able to, she's not able to use the tackle as effectively. Which is good! So good. Alright. Alright. Sweet scent. You smell. But you smell sweet. Mmm, I'm less evasive now. I want you to be next to me. 
tackle into my arms. Oh, wait. I did it too hard. Sorry. Sorry. And 18 for Mr. Squirrel. Fuck yeah. Wonderful work. Good job, gentlemen. Done like dinner. You're fucking right. And back to the Pokemon Center! Alright, so we're back on Route 3. I think I am about ready to uh, glimpse what the grass might hold for us. Is this a trainer? Did you touch me? Well, no. <laughs> I just saw you moving, so I didn't think you'd try and fight me, but alright. If you want to fight, we could, we could fight too. She's got a Mew. Oh, fuck. Okay, I'm just gonna growth up a little bit. Oh, Mew only has pounds. It's not not so bad. I should have fucking caught that shit with the bide, though. That's all right. Now we're growthed. Get that swift on, yeah. Oh, that that's that's terrible. All right, bye, bye. Get the pounds. Oh shit. Now it's transformed into me. That's horrible. Oh my god! Unleash your energy! Boosh! Bide, okay. So we can get a free switch into something. Thank goodness. I didn't know that Mew would transform. That's freaking crazy. So should I hit it or just like. I'm a supersonic first. Yeah. Unleashed energy, that's great. I know you don't have a plant move because you're my Pokemon! Ha ha ha! <laughs> and, uh, Icicle Spear. Icicle Spear! Yeah! Hurt yourself, boo! Da 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 da! Fuck yeah! Shut it down! I used my own Pokemon against me! Acorn's level 18, good job, Bo. Clam Slam's getting there. I know he'll get XP, because we're going through the Rock Tunnel. Or, not the Rock Tunnel, Mount Moon. <laughs> uh, let's switch Clam Slam to the front, and see what the first Pokemon we get in this grass might be. Got 15 Pokeballs to catch it. What's it gonna be? Larvitar. Hmm. Well, I know I can't hit that thing with uh, Icicle Spear for fear of killing it. So we'll just whittle it down with Tackle. Just a little bit. Yeah, not very effective. Good. Good! And he's whipped up a Sandstorm. That's interesting. I think Clam Slam uh, dislikes the sand just a little bit. It might turn my water Pokemon into mud. We'll get another Tackle. Don't crit it, don't crit it. It's gonna be good. Yes, I want this Larvitar. Just imagine a Tyranitar on my team. <laughs> That's also more fighting type weakness. Shit. Uh, let's, let's, let's. Let's try a Pokeball. I don't have anything to give it status, so uh, we'll just try a Pokeball. Come with us, Larvitar! It's gonna be a grand old time, we'll train you up ten levels in no time. Oh god. It was so close! And now he's biting me. Bro, I want to be friends. I'm not friends with people who bite me, you see? I can't do that. Okay. Hang in there, Clam Slam. We're gonna get him right now. One, two, gah! Maybe we need to give it another tackle. I need to make it happen before uh, we take too much damage out here. Clam Slam's taking half his health already. Do not crit it. All right, good job. Now it should be no problem to try and catch this thing. Sandstorm's over. Good. So I won't miss with my Pokeball. Go Pokeball! One, two. Three? Fuck! Ah, <laughs> oh, it doesn't want to come with us. Come on, bro. It's gonna be a good time, I promise. I can't tackle you again. 
I don't want to waste all my Pokeballs. Please, please, please. Yes. Thank God. We caught a Larvitar. Let's see what the Pokedex say. When it's born deep underground, it can't emerge until it has entirely cons consumed the soil around it. Hmm. I guess Rocky would be a good name for it, but, uh... I kind of want to name it Elvis, which is the name that I usually save for a Nidoking, King, but we ain't got no Nidoking. King. I know Tyranitar's the real king. Alright, so we caught a poke. Let's, uh, continue on. See if we can't make our way to Mount Moon, and I'm gonna put Elvis in the front. Cause he's now the baby! Aww. So cute! Nice flowers. You just appreciate everything more. I think that guy wants to battle us, but... I ain't fucking with it! And now we're on Route 4, which, uh, I don't know if Route 4 actually has any grass on it. Welcome to our Pokémon Center! Why, thank you so much! Boo-boo-doo-boo! Thank you for waiting! We have restored your Pokémon to full health! That is most kind of you. Team Rocket attacks Cerulean citizens! Not a day goes by without Team Rocket being in the news. Ain't that the truth. Sometimes you have too many Pokémon and you need to add more. In that case, you should just store some using the PC. Wow. What a thing. Hello there, laddie. Have I got a deal just for you? I'll let you have a secret Pokemon, a magic card for just 500 Poke. So you'll buy it, am I right? You are. <laughs> I want to give a nickname to the magic card. I'm gonna name him McFish because I like a McDonald's fish fillet. <laughs> so we caught two more Pokemon. We can actually go in Mount Moon and catch one more, uh, really quick. I think. That would be a, a pertinent thing to do. Is it dark in here? I can't remember. I don't have flash yet. Nah, it's good. We're good. So let's see what Mount Moon has for us. TM12. Got Taunt. Interesting. And our Pokemon for Mount Moon is a Glalie. Well. That's interesting. Go ahead and bite it. Oh, he's fucking double teaming. That dick. We'll have to do some training with our Glalie. And, uh, little. I can't even remember his name. Elvis. Do not die to a Glalie, please. Oh shit, I fucked up. <laughs> Super effective move. And Elvis is frozen solid. That's, that's wonderful. At least I know this Glalie's a fucking go getter. Alright, come back, Elvis. And, uh, we'll send Clam Slam. I think Clam Slam will be able to whittle it down pretty well with Icicle Spear. Although, if it gets like a five hit, I don't know. Fucking double team. It's gonna be really great to be on my team, but now I definitely can't hit it with Supersonic. <laughs> ah! Now it's biting me. Stop biting me! My real friends don't bite me! There we go. Little bit of fucking icicle spear. Just for you. I should have got the sandstorm up, maybe. Man. That don't do much at all. Aw, oh, fuck. Ah, Clam Slam is frozen as well. Wonderful. We're gonna have a whole team full of frozen Pokemon. Let's, uh. McFish can't do anything yet. Now he's the real baby. <laughs> but once he evolves into Gyarados, uh, we should be able to have the flying type resistance to fighting, which is super important. Fuck. I really hope Tackle doesn't kill this thing. Let's just try a Pokeball. I hope it just I hope it just gets in there, and it's really nice. Nope. <laughs> Not at all. And it's still double teaming. God damn it. Can we just hit it? Hit it with a tackle. If it doesn't die, then it wants to come with us. Okay! Alright, stop! <laughs> Hammer time! Oh my god. 
I almost destroyed this fucking Galele. All right. But now you have no choice. You have to come with us. Ha-ha! Good. Good. Shit. I've had it with these motherfucking Glalies and these motherfucking Pokeballs. <laughs> come on, bro. Just do it for me. Do it for daddy. You got a fucking sliver of HP left. It's not gonna happen. You'll never escape. God damn. Am I going to waste every single Pokeball on a Galalee? Yes. Yes, I am. <laughs> I'm going to fucking catch this fucker. Level up my team. We're going to make it through Mount Moon. Yeah! What a dick. This guy was so determined not to come with us. What you say, Pokedex? It has a body of ice that won't melt, even with fire. It can instantly freeze moisture in the atmosphere. That's the easy one. Gotta give him a nickname. My name is Mr. Freeze. I'm Mr. White Christmas. I'm Mr. Snow. They call me Snow Miser everywhere I go. So, friends, this has been uh, another part of the Pokemon Nuzlocke. We've got a full team. Thank God. I do hope that you guys will join us for whatever comes next. Probably the horrors of Mount Moon, as well as that trainer we forgot to battle earlier. So, if you did enjoy, I hope you will co like, comment, and or subscribe. And until the next time, friends. Bye-bye! One, two, three, four. Goodbye, Mr. Goodbye, goodbye, see you, my friend.